Hi guys, Mr. Murphy again. So this is standard 7.rp.2, uh, ratios and proportions 2, and that is recognizing and representing proportional relationships between quantities. Um, this is set into four different substandards, so we're going to look at substandard 7.rp.2a first. Uh, decide whether two quantities are proportional relationship, for example, by testing for equivalent ratios in a table or graphing on a coordinate plane and observing whether the graph is a straight line through the origin. So first we're going to look at testing for equivalent ratios in a table. So here's a table, x and y. Uh, it's proportional, it starts at 0, 0 and goes up by 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 12, so it's going up by a constant rate. So we're going to look at uh, test for equivalency. The ratios and fractions are not the same thing, but they're very similar, and sometimes you can think of ratios as fractions, even though they're not. Like the ratio 1 to 4 is one thing uh, versus 4 out of a total of 5 things whereas a fraction is one part of four. But they can still be tested in equivalency in the same manner. So if I take these ratios, 1 fourth, 2 eighths, and 3 twelfths, and see if they're equivalent. <clears throat> so is 1 fourth equal to 2 eighths equal to 3 twelfths? Well, 1 fourth times 2 halves equals 2 eighths, so those are equivalent. And also 1 fourth times 3 thirds equals 3 twelfths. So those are equivalent. So yes, look at, in, look at ratios like fractions and multiplying by 1 to see if I can get an equal equivalent fraction proves that these are in a proportional relationship. So <clears throat> x and y here are in a proportional relationship because they start at 0 and all of these ratios are proportional. The second half of the standard says graphing on a coordinate plane and observing whether the graph is a straight line through the origin. And this is really as simple as it sounds. So if I graph something, does it go through the origin? So you look down at the bottom, it's hidden right now. There where it's at the zero, the blue dot, that's zero, zero, that's the origin of a graph. Is it a straight line? Yes, so it goes from 0, 0 and goes up, goes up over 1, up 3, or it goes up 3 and over 1, up another 1, 2, 3, and over 1, up another 3, and over 1. So it's always going up the same amount every time it goes over 1. So it's a consistent movement, so it is a straight line starting at 0, 0. So that's the two things. Uh, is it a straight line that goes through the origin, and are the ratios equivalent? Uh, 